Hello everyone, welcome to LBS IS Academy. Today we are going to discuss Thought and Culture MCQs based on previous year UPSC questions. So let's start our session. Our first question is The Nagara, the Dravida and the Vesara are included in which of the following category? Answer to this question is Option B. The three main styles of Indian temple architectures. Ancient Indian temples are classified in three broad types. This classification is based on different architectural styles employed in the construction of these temples. The three types are Nagara, Vesara and Dravida. Nagara style temples are found in northern India. Vesara style temples in region between Vindhyas and the river Krishna. And Dravida style temples are found between Godavari and Krishna rivers. Which one of the following temples figured in the news regarding institution of Devadasis? Option A. Jagannath Temple Option B. Pashupatinath Temple Option C. Khandarya Mahadev Temple Option D. Chausat Yogini Temple Here answer to this question is Option A. Jagannath Temple Puri Devadasis were a common feature in almost all the major Brahmanical temples Devadasi is a girl dedicated to worship and the service of a deity or a temple for the rest of her life. They were considered the human wife of Lord Jagannath. In the context of ancient Indian society, which one of the following terms does not belong to the category of the other three? Options here are Kula, Vamsha, Kosa and Gotra. Here, answer to this question is option C, Kosa. Kosa was used for treasury and the rest of the three other terms were related to family. Vamsa is a Sanskrit word that signifies family lineage. Gotra structures an exogamous unit with the marriage inside the equivalent Gotra being restricted by custom. Kula depicts the patriarchal nuclear family. Which one of the following sculptures invariably used green schist as the medium? Options are Mauryan sculptures, Madura sculptures, Bharut sculptures, Gandhara sculptures. Here answer to this question is option C, Bharut sculptures. Bharut sculptures used green schist as the medium means in the sculpture, green schist metamorphic rocks were used. Bharut sculpture is an early Indian sculpture of Shrunka period that decorated the great stupa or relic mound of Bharut in Madhya Pradesh state. Sculptures similar to the Bharat remains are located throughout northern India. The term Apabramsa was used in medieval Sanskrit text to denote Option A. Outcast among the Rajput Option B. Deviation from Vedic rituals Option C. Early forms of some of the modern Indian languages Option D. Non-Sanskrit verse matters Here answer to this question is Option C. Early form of some of the modern Indian languages Abhabramsa in Sanskrit literally means corrupt or non-grammatical language which deviates from the norm of Sanskrit grammar. It denotes dialects province in the Ganges region. Which one of the following text of ancient India allows divorce to a wife deserted by her husband? Option A. Kama Sutra Option B. Manava Dharma Shastra Option C. Shukranidishara Option D. Artha Shastra Here answer to this question is Option D. Artha Shastra According to social law of ancient India, a woman was always considered a minor. Divorce was prohibited, although it sometimes took place. According to the Artha Shastra, a wife who had been deserted by her husband could seek a divorce. Artha Shastra was written by Kautilya. Which one of the following pairs is correctly matched? Option A. Nakul Bihar Option B. Tamasha Orissa Option C. Angyanad Azam Option D. Baha Punjab Here answer to this question is Option C. Angyanad Angyanads are a class of one X plays performed in Azam. The invention of the Angyanad is usually attributed to the medieval saint and social reformer Shankadeva. This art form makes use of large masks of gods, goddesses, demons and animals. These plays were written in an artificial Assamese mightily mixed language called Brajavali and are primarily centered on Krishna. Tamasha is a traditional folk theater form of Maharashtra. Which one of the following pairs is not correctly matched? Option A. Korku Maharashtra. That is correct. Option B. Jumar Haryana. That is also correct. Option C. Tali Himachal Pradesh. That is not correct. Option D. Mugna Manipur. That is also correct. So here answer to this question is option C. Tali. Tali is the folk dance of Rajasthan, not the folk dance of Himachal Pradesh. 
Korku is not a folk dance. Their tribes mostly resides in Madhya Pradesh, Chhattisgarh and adjoining Melgarh region of Maharashtra. Jhumar dance is folk dance popular in Haryana. The folk dance of Jhumar initially originated from Balochistan and Multan. It also thrived into areas of Punjab and Pakistan. Mukna is a form of folk wrestling from the northeast Indian state Manipur. Which of the following pairs is correctly matched? Option A Guru Amar Das Miriyan Peri that is incorrect. Option B Guru Arjun Dev Adi Gran that is correct. Option C Guru Ram Das Dal Khalsa that is not correct. Option D Guru Gobind Singh Manje that is incorrect. So here answer to this question is option B Guru Arjun Dev compiled Adi Gran. Guru Har Gobind introduced the concept of Miri and Peri to Sikhism. Guru Gobind Singh founded the Sikh warrior community called Khalsa. Guru Amar Das introduced religious organization the manji system guru ramdas founded amritsar the holiest city of sikhism he is also remembered in the sikh tradition for expanding the manji organization for clerical appointments which one of the following pairs of composers in different languages and their works on the mahabharata theme is correctly matched option a saraladasa bengali that is incorrect option b kashirama orya that is incorrect option c tikkanna marathi that is also incorrect Option D Pampa Kannada that is correct so here answer to this question is option D Pampa Kannada Pampa was a Kannada poet whose works reflected his philosophical beliefs Vikramarjuna Vijaya also known as Pampa Bharata is a Kannada version of the Mahabharata of Vyasa Saraladasa wrote Oriya version of the Mahabharata Kashirama wrote Bengali version of the Mahabharata Nannaya Tikkanna and Eranna known as the Trinity of Poets wrote Telugu version of the Mahabharata Match list one with list two and select the correct answer using the codes given below. Here, Brat Samhita is a script written in Indian Sanskrit by author Varaha Mehra, Devi Chandra Guptam written by Vishagadatta, Marchagadigam written by Sudraga, and Vikramanga Teva Charita written by Bilhana. And Prabandha Chintamani is a collection of Prabandhas compiled by Meru Tunga. Varaha Mehra also wrote. Pancha Siddhantika and Vishagadatta also wrote Mudra Rakshasa. So here answer to this question is option B.